How you doing guys? How are you? And today, I'm going to talk about Destiny. More specifically, the new Exact Pulse Rifle, the Outbreak Crime. Which I personally am not a big fan of. You know, I expected a lot more from it. You know, it just doesn't give me a reason to take off any of my other exotics. Like the Galahorn, or even other legendary Pulse Rifles. Like the new Trials Pulse Rifle, for example, which is a fucking monster. Or like, I don't know. I don't know what else is good. Things like the Talk Saw, or the... Grass of Melloc, you'd probably be better off with those. It just doesn't seem worth taking up the exotic slot, in my personal opinion. And considering the quest is like the longest fucking thing I've ever done in my life, because you gotta do the raid, and then do some binary, and do more of the raid, and then do some math, and then do the raid again, and then some more math, and then it's just, it takes so long. And it's just. It just seems quite underwhelming for the amount of time put into it. Now, I'm not saying it's bad, but there's just a lot of things that, like, there's, like, a lot more you could do with your exotic slot. Like, you could have a fancy little, well, like, the Galahorn. Like, it, that's the best gun ever. <laughs> it just doesn't give me a reason to take it off, which makes me very sad. Because, you know, I wanted to, I really want to, like, like, I want to use it, but it just doesn't seem good enough for me to want to use it. Like... I could, I could just do so much more with other exotics. Oh, I just expected more, to be honest. Makes me very sad. I do like using it though. It is fun to use. It's a, when you think about it, it's essentially a pulse rifle with wolf pack rounds. Which, which, just saying that, makes it sound like it's really, really good. But it just doesn't work out. I mean, if it was just wolf pack rounds on a pulse rifle, that would just be stupid and that would break the entire game. But, like, it, it does need it. It is balanced quite well, but it's just not... I don't know, I'm just trying to think of what they could do to make it so it's not as underpowered as I think it is. Like, the... what are they called? The Siva Swarm business? It just doesn't really... In PvP, it doesn't seem to do enough damage. Like, it seems like it does a very little amount of damage. There's like 9 or something? I don't know, I'm not sure whether that's right. It's, that's what I remember from just the top of my head. And, like, it only procs from a headshot. Well, it can proc from a body shot, but I have not seen that happen in PvP once. It happens in PvE a lot. I do, it's like, I reckon it's probably better in PvE than PvP, to be honest. Just because the enemies sort of aren't as smart as real people, <laughs> if, uh, if you get what I mean. But, you know, you know, it's decent. I'll give it that. It's decent. But, you know, considering all the effort I put into it, like, the fucking... I had to do the raid twice because the first time we attempted it, it just didn't work. And the lasers that blocked the chest weren't even... weren't even there. And... well, they were there, which was the problem. And uh, they just had to do it again. And then it was... and then... Uh, it's just... It's a process. I'll fucking tell you that much. Like, God. Anyway, that's all I wanted to talk about. I was just, just wanted to have a little bit of a rant about this this weapon. And yes, I've been grinding out Destiny quite a lot recently since it came out. Well, like two, the Rise of Iron came out two weeks ago. I've been playing the shit out of it, and it's very fun. And maybe more videos in the future. We'll see what happens. We'll see. We'll see. But recently, I have downloaded Black Ops Three on PC. So I can play some custom zombies maps. So that'll be that'll be exciting. I was playing a little bit last night. That was that was pretty fun. So, uh, yeah, yeah, I think that's it. I'll talk to you guys next time. Goodbye.